Early last fall, a young lady named Diane McKeever realized that this was the 75th vineyard coming up and thought it would be a really neat idea to have a painting done of some sort. And she uh, thought it would be a neat idea if we had an early winner of the vineyard and a more recent one, so Cotton Blossom II, Walter Wheeler's boat from 1934, I believe, won the vineyard, and Blue Yankee won it in 2007, and then the uh, vineyard lightship, you know, in the background. A highly uh, unlikely combination, I'll grant you, but artistic license. You notice, uh, if you look carefully, you can, Blue Yankee is just a tad above the ley line there. She's gotten lifted on that northeaster, which accounts for the reason that all those fellas are climbing up off the rail and heading to uh, ease the sheets a tad. And, of course, there's a couple of our towels in the back urging them to get with it uh, quickly. The research takes a good chunk of that. Uh, what do you do, especially to a boat like Blue Yankee? You, you, you're going to get it right. There are too many people that have sailed on it and will be all over your case if you got it wrong. I gave it to the Stanford Yacht Club. They've already made a, a poster out of it. They're going to have it reproduced on canvas, I'm told, as well. And it'll uh, hopefully hang on a wall here uh, where people can see it. Mm -hmm.